What's going on, everybody? Well, here's my girl. Not the prettiest, not the fanciest, but she can do it all. Everything I need to get the job done is in here. Let's see what I got. Well, let's start off with the shorties. I don't need the whole manifold set for me to kind of take that every single call. Nah, no thank you. Well, I'll just grab the shorties. I can check the pressures. I can make sure everything's good. Don't really need to carry that whole set with me. Don't need the digital ones either. These are old school. $10 a piece. I'm good with that. And now, my multimeter. I cannot run any service call without this. I'm useless. If you don't have this, might as well turn around and go home. Go get it. You can't run any service call without a multimeter. I like this one because as I'm checking it, I'm looking into the reading. I know some of them you put them in the wall, but you're looking away as your hands are right there in 208. So this is my favorite one. Next, my flashlight. In the middle of the night, you know, you're trying to hold it with your neck or something. Nah, this one has a magnet tip, so all I have to do is just literally put it on top of the panel. And there you go. And next, my crescent. Papa crescent, baby crescent. I need both of them in my bag. For this one, you can see I'm using it for the Centronic oil fill to take it out. It's usually what I use. For the smaller one, usually caps. I don't want to use the big one on it. Put too much pressure, possibly bend something. I'll just, I'll just use the baby one. And now, my service wrenches. You can't do anything without these as well. If you're going to valve off a compressor, turn it back on, you need these. For the self-contains, to get readings, to open them up, open the system, you need these service wrenches. Next, these Craftsman's wrenches. I love these bad boys, man. Usually take off the heads, 916s on top, put fittings on the side for pressure controls. It's usually half inch. Even for the oil float for the side class, if you want to clean it, it's a 716s. I love these. Next, my crimpers. I do a lot of EMS, so for dolphins, I use them for belt-in to respice sensors. A lot of them too is to cut zip ties. When I'm checking wiring for shorts, when I, gotta, when I gotta go through all the wiring, start cutting all these. And my strippers. 22 gauge, which is mostly belt-in 22.3, and then 12 gauge, here they are. And my pliers. I don't use them the right way. I usually just use them just to pull fuses. I actually found those, so oh my god, might as well use them, pull up some fuses. And the pocket screwdriver, the little MVP himself. So for this, when I have to mess with sensors or the little small wiring, even to get into the machine room doors, you know what I'm talking about. And then these beautiful things. When you're replacing a coil and you're messing with those long threaded rods, these guys are wonderful. And of course the socket wrenches. If you can't get it with the other wrench, you bring out the socket and make sure you can get any part out. 
Here you can see how I'm applying it. I'm going to take off the compressor, replace it. I already have it in my bag to do it. Ready to go. And of course, you need a pipe wrench for those drain lines in the boxes. To open it up, open the drain. Here you can see I'm going to use it just to remove this out of the way. And my fluke. How I check the temps for the cases, for my lines. You can see right here. It's my girl right here. This one I checked the product temp. Usually when they say the case is fine, it's a 32, you gotta check the product temp because that's what they checked. Health goes by product temp, not discharge air. My Schrader pack. There's always Schrader's leaking, so I always carry a little pack with me. If I need to replace it, it's already in my bag. I don't have to go to the van. And my star key. I mainly use these when I'm working in the drives because they have that star fitting where to remove them, the covers. So that's the only time I use them. All this in such a small package. All these goodies. Oh man, caps. You gotta carry caps. There's always caps missing. You gotta just put it in. That's about it. I mean, 17 years in these supermarkets and this is pretty much all the stuff I need to do my job. I really don't take that many trips to the van to get more tools. I can do it all with this. And if I can't do it with this, then we're in deep shit. Thank you for watching. Leave a like, subscribe, put a comment, any questions. Thank you for watching. I almost forgot this little guy. Holy shit. I found this in a parking lot 15 years ago. I love it. I love it. Love it. Love it.